fact, we bombed Bashar al-Assad, we bombed Saddam Hussein, we threatened to bomb Kim Jong-un. We applaud Israel and give them money. And weapons. Right now, the Senate already passed a bill to send $14 billion for more slaughter. It's a slaughterhouse in Gaza. Every day that we delay, the IDF murders, murders more Palestinians. It, uh, today, Lloyd Austin, our Secretary of Defense, admitted in uh, in testimony in Congress, Israel has murdered more than 25,000 women and children. Women and children. Remember that our hearts broke and we said it on this show for 36 babies that were killed in Israel. 36 children. And that should break your heart. You've got 25,000 dead babies, children, women stacked on top of one another. And now 576,000 people murdered that are starving and desperate and eating animal fodder. What kind of sick maniacs do this? Terrorists do this. Benjamin Netanyahu is 100% a terrorist and one of the worst terrorists of my lifetime. 25 times the terrorist that Hamas is. Definitely a terrorist. It don't give me this nonsense that, oh, when Arabs do it or when Muslims do it and when the powerless do it, they're no good scumbag terrorists. But when a state does it, a so called ally does it, and they do it a 25, 30 times worse. No, no, angels. They had to do it. No, you, you cannot be in favor of this. If you're in favor of this, you have lost your soul. You have lost your morality. You have lost decency. The IDF now is the largest terrorist organization in the world. If you say, "Oh no, that's not fair. That's not fair. We were just murdering 30,000 of them and starving them and humiliating them and shooting them with drones and treating them like animals." But you don't get to call us names. You don't get to call us names. No, I do get to call you names. Israel is one of the worst governments on earth right now. And if you care about Israel, and I don't, I think you know, people are so blinded, blinded by their bias. But if you say the Palestinians, who gives a goddamn about them? Murder, murder, murder them. Who cares about the Palestinians? We have a right to defend ourselves. Get the hell out of here. That defense ended months and months and months ago. This is just brutality and savagery. So if you if it breaks your heart to hear the truth, good, good, do something about it. And so if you only if you do, if you don't mind murdering Palestinians and treating them like animals, how about Israel? Listen, you fools, you utter utter fools. The right wing government of Israel are stupid monsters in our Congress. Do you not understand? We are all seeing this. Your lies about how Israel has to do it, doesn't, no one believes it. No one other than the propaganda filled, vice filled heads in Washington. The rest of us look at it and what do you think's happening? What do you think the world thinks about Israel now? Do you not get it, you schmucks? You unbelievable idiots. If Turkey was doing this, when Turkey did what 1% of this, I was furious because it's gonna make people hate me. Do you not get it? Are you so thick headed you can't get it? The world now despises Israel because of this. No, it's because they're, we're the victims. Is this, is this what, a, who, who looks at that tape and says the Palestinians are not the victims, the Israelis murdering them are the victims? United you would States have government. to be a lunatic to believe that. So the people in power in our government, that's the people we can affect. Those politicians, they're the worst people on earth. They approve that $14 billion to murder more of these poor innocent people. They are the most immoral people I have ever seen in my lifetime. They don't speak for me. I'm not for the monsters in Washington. I'm 100% against those monsters, yes, including that despicable, like awful human being, Joe Biden. Joe Biden looks at that and goes, send him more money, send him more bombs, kill them, kill them, kill them. That's what Joe Biden says. Same goddamn thing Donald Trump says. Our leaders are monsters. And you think you idiots, you think you're helping Israel? You're getting the whole world to despise Israel. You morons, you've done so much damage to Palestinians and to Israelis. 
but keep murdering and see if you can murder your way out of this. Outrageous. If your heart doesn't break, you don't have one.